Hey, oh, I've got these TV heads. I've got 12 of them here. Uh, they didn't have a case, but they had 12 um, that I could buy, and it's the Artist Series. And here are all the different artists that uh, painted on or designed these. Here's the cool thing. They're from 2007, 2007. so they're 16 years old, which is pretty amazing, by Kaching Brands, which I guess no longer exists. Um, but I'm not quite sure how many there are um, on the website. I counted how many were on here, but it didn't match up with the picture on the website because the picture showed 10, and it also said that there was a secret. So I don't know if that one in the top middle there is the secret or if they show the secret or what. No clue, so I have no clue what we're gonna get. But it said the series was designed by Glenn Murakami, who is the producer of Justice League, Teen Titans, and Batman, and also uh, designed by Alan Wan. So I think that's the sculpt they're talking about, and these are the artists who actually painted or designed the sculpt. But let's uh, let's find out, since we have no idea what we're gonna get that makes it you know kind of exciting in my opinion. Uh, oh wow, they're packaged very well. Uh, so they are blind box, but not a blind bag. There's no checklist in there. Um, well, that's interesting. He is not in the picture and not on the box. Is this dude the secret? I have no idea. Whoa, baby. Okay, so this is this is pretty cool. Oh my gosh, look at this. So KOA, I have no idea what that means. Uh, these are super light. I can tell they're hollow inside. This, the bunny ears, that's what I used to call them. Uh, rotate and how cool is that look at the stand the stand is an outlet how cute is that so this is a pretty cool design I gotta say so the head moves it's kind of cool this has been sitting in the box for 16 years so here's all the pieces to attach it to the stand honestly though I don't think I want to put it on the stand I like the way it looks by itself, but I want to put at least one of them on the stand. Sounds like I'm prosecuting them. Um, oh, okay, so here is the charging block. So you can plug it in, which is really cute. That's what it looks like on the bottom there. Oh, so you know what? I believe it says that they all have this option where you can display it like this or just like this, or he can just simply stand here. So it looks like we have another piece here and we have this piece here if you just want them on a, a shorter stand. I see, so that plugs in there. So you can either sit him like, like this. Well, that doesn't go with that. I'm not sure how that works. Maybe he just, I can't believe that he would just wobble there. Maybe he does, maybe he does just wobble there. <laughs> Well, this will be pretty interesting because I have no idea what to expect. If we're gonna get a whole set or even how many are in the full set, I have no idea. Okay, this guy was on the box and in the picture. These are really cool. The sculpt is pretty amazing and I love the designs on it as well. Um, I cannot read that but the editing me will be able to read it. You'll be able to read it. This is really cute. So it kind of looks like the, that, that popular ape design or something. Although maybe, maybe one of these designers is the designer who created the bape or bathing ape or whatever it was. I don't know. I just remember in 2008, there was like this super popular ape brand. I am not into the whole hype culture at all, so I don't really know about popular stuff. I just, if I like something, I like it because of the way it looks. Um, I don't really get into the whole what's popular and what's not thing. I just kind of go with what I like. Um, nothing wrong with stuff that's popular, obviously. It's just not my thing. If, if it's something I don't like, I just, I don't know. I just like what I like, I guess. This is really cute. I like those cutesy little skulls. It's 
pretty adorable. I like this one a lot and I like the pink antennas. This is a really cool concept. So it is kind of fun sometimes to have no idea how many are in a set. I guess I'd rather know everything that's in the set and in what's possible to get, but it is kind of fun, you know, for things to be a mystery. Okay, so this guy was on the box and you know, I bet he's the secret. <laughs> Seriously, how insane is that? I bet he is. How crazy is that, that I get a secret that's been sitting there for 16 years? This is pretty cool. It looks like an old space station graphics or something. Not sure what that says. That's really cool. It's like a spaceman inside the TV. Now, I had never heard of these before. You guys will have to let me know if you have heard of these. Um, I know a lot of designs and brands have gone out of business in the past 16 years or so. Oh, okay, so we got our first duplicate. Yeah, I think back then it was less popular to get a full set in a case. Um, of course, this isn't a case and I don't know how many came in a case either. Uh, okay, second duplicate. But I just ordered 12 since they didn't have a case on the website, thinking, oh, maybe a case had 12, I don't know. But, you know, the other thing is back then, I think they had more to a case back then. Okay, good, we got a new one. Oh, this guy is cute. That looks like uh, kind of an old 60s design, doesn't it? What does that say? Ah, I can't read it. I'll be able to uh, see it better when I'm editing, but Got cute little horns on the side. I suppose that's probably the artist. Is that, wait, is that Sket One? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. That is pretty cute though. I love it. We've still got five left and I'm still dying to know if I got the secret. Because I couldn't find it online. Okay, there's another duplicate. This is definitely old school where you get tons of duplicates and not guaranteed a full set. Let's see, oh my gosh, another duplicate. Yeah, we're definitely not gonna get all 10, that's for sure, that, we, that I saw listed on the website. But I don't know, that one wasn't listed, so I'm pretty sure that's the secret. Oh my gosh, Sean, another duplicate. I know that the old kid robot cases, you would never get, or rarely anyway, a full set. Oh, cute. Okay, I'm glad we got this one, because I love the cutesy cartoony stuff. That's pretty adorable. I do like the colors, that magenta and deep purple. That's pretty cool. Oh, he's cute. I like the little octopus. Well, I don't know if it's an octopus. That's kind of what it looks like, but I'm not sure which artist, who is who. It doesn't seem to have their signature or logo anywhere on them. I suppose if I looked up all the artists, you'd be able to tell by their style. He's pretty cute. Last one, guys. Oh, I really hope it is not a duplicate. I really hope we get a, a new one. Come on, no duplicate, no duplicate. Oh, awesome, no duplicate. And you know what, I kind of wanted this one. I don't know why I didn't say that earlier, but the skull is just really unique. I just, I don't know, I think that skull is just super cute. Oh, he's adorable with his little button pants. Oh, look, look cute, look at his little money symbol uh, necklace. Oh, that's adorable. And oh, this is mad. So yeah, second artist there, I believe, is mad. That's pretty adorable. I like this one a lot. Here are all the ones we got out of 12. We got seven unique ones. Um, this one is definitely my favorite. I do like every single one of them, though. That one would be my second favorite. I think that's the secret. I don't know. Let me know what you think, you guys. And please tell me. I'd love to know what's your favorite out of all of these, and what do you think of these older toys? I think they're pretty cool. Thanks so much for hanging out with me and we'll see you next time.